All right, so we're gonna go ahead and unbox this uh, package. That's pretty good. Pretty thick packaging. Why am I not using a cutter? I don't know. Because the scissors, the first thing I grabbed, so. a slip down so we'll open up and then another slip across here open it up. So, the box reads out XXL, this is the Bell qualifier, so XXL in the box, obviously we gotta take a look at what's inside. It has a uh, checkered flag dust bag, okay. And, um, not totally concerned with whatever else is inside. I gotta take a look at it right away if the size on the box matches the uh, size on the size tag of the motorcycle helmet. All right, so the size on the sticker on the side of the uh, head is XXL okay but well, obviously you gotta I, I want to verify the size on the uh, label inside it has a double ring or a double D ring sorry so like that let's take a look at the size of the inside and um, yeah it checks out so the inside size also says XXL okay so um, that should be legit XXL. Now might as well uh, do a fit test while I have this thing here. Okay. Hmm, smells brand new. All right. By the way, this is the Z-Ray, uh, qualifier Z-Ray, okay? Let's put this thing on. I can't find my uh, ba 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 baklava, whatever that thing is, baklava. I should do the work though. Very, very snug right now, but uh, obviously that's the, uh, you know, first few days fit. So 
I'm, I'm good with it. Okay, so. All right, perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, what we have here is the Bell Qualifier Z-Ray, okay? This is a pretty nice helmet, okay? So um, let's just uh, look at what we have here. So starting from the top, you will see here that there is this, um, there's a vent here that you open up by um, sliding this. So I'm gonna open that. And then on the other side is the same slide you're gonna go open that so pushing it back is open so when you close it um, just like how you when you close your shield you go forward and then when you're taking your shield off um, then you go backwards so same here same thing here so uh, it's important to remember that when you're riding because you know you don't want to second guess yourself when it's when it's really hot already and your brain is boiling in there and you don't even know if your vent is open or closed so you just go like this and like that while you're riding it's easy okay so i'm going to leave that open because i like my vents open okay speaking of vents uh there's also a vent right here in the front same thing same principle same gesture you push it forward going like that just like opening your shield uh and then you you push it down when you're gonna um when you're gonna open it okay so that's that close open okay so um, and then uh, you have the uh, these are your basically your exhaust vents in the back right here okay uh, that's where the air will be coming out once it enters on all these three vents okay and then um, obviously you have your your sh your your shield here and uh, it's uh, it stops very nicely on on each of the stages of, of it okay and then um, also I was told that um, this is right this right here is a uh, quick release you just click that and it will release uh, the, the shield okay and um, the inside I'm not gonna tear this thing apart because I barely know this this helmet I might not be able to put it back Plus, I'm excited to uh, take it out already and, and try it out. So um, I'm not gonna undo all of that. You can just watch the other videos for undoing that. I'm pretty sure that a five-year-old design helmet, you know, that's all the videos about that is already out there. So I'm not gonna do that. Anyway, so um, I'm curious about these buttons over here uh, of what they do, but um, I don't know. Um, we'll, we'll find out later okay and then uh, obviously it's padded really nicely and then you have also an exit uh, vent over here by the way over here okay so um, and then you also have the the crossbones right there where it's called you know it's beautiful I like it so um, the bell here is not a sticker that you can just peel off but the bell branding here is uh, is painted so it's, it's cool you know I I can deal with that it's no problem okay but uh, other than that guys I'm very very satisfied you have a double D ring over here by the way uh, that's nice and then once you close the D ring there's the snap that you put there okay I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest with you I haven't used a helmet that has a double D ring what I have was an L what what I have right now is a LS2 and then they use the, uh, the snap kind okay so um so uh yeah i mean i'm very very happy about this I finally got a legit helmet and stuff that, that i can rock and stuff okay but uh other than that guys i i'm i don't really think that i'm gonna be having so much helmets i know some people who's got tons of helmets but for me it's like i i just pick out one and then uh one that's good and uh, then I'll, I'll, I'll be, I'll, I'll be alright for, for the rest of the year I think, okay? 
um, unless you know I get a helmet addiction all of a sudden. But uh, other than that, helmet is helmet to me. But uh, oh, by the way, this thing has a dual certification from DOT and also ECE. So um, so it's uh, it's it's pretty good. It's pretty good to have both of those. Okay. So um, are there flaws on this particular item that I got? Nah. Very, very minimal. Nothing I can live with. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, other than that, uh, thank you very much for watching my channel. And uh, I know this is just a bang up uh, quick video tutorial, not tutorial, but uh, unboxing and, 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 and review. But uh, this, as far as the, 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 the quality and um, durability, this this helmet, like I said, it's it's old helmet, all design helmet. So it's it's tested and 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 and, and attested by a lot of uh, users, beginners and 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 pros alike. Uh, they they like this stuff. Okay, that's why I got it too. So um, and uh, it's under two hundred dollars. So uh, it's it's a legit, good priced, quality helmet. Okay. Uh, other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching my channel. I'll see you on my next uh, unboxing. Okay. Later.